I've been having a little problem starting. It doesn't want to start. It, once it's starting, it runs good. I just bought a compression tester. We're going to do a compression test today. Just got it at um, Harbor Freight for about 30 bucks. So we're going to do a quick compression test. Um, stay tuned, okay? Here's what comes in the compression tester. You got one, two, three of different spark plug sizes and the compression tester, long hose with an adapter. And you also got the directions. Stay tuned, okay? All I gotta do now is take the spark plug off so I can put the compression tester on it. Here's where the spark plug is. There's a spark plug. Gotta find the, the right um, one. This one looks like it. Alright, one minute, I'll be right back. Well, guess what? We got a problem. The compression tester does not have the same size spark plug as my scooter. So it means I can't do a compression test. Which you can see, there's the smallest. There's my spark plug. I'll have to go see if Harbor Freight has different sizes. Darn. Oh well, I'll be back. Thanks. All right. Well, I couldn't. I couldn't find my. Uh, I couldn't find the compression tester adapter for the ten millimeter. So I'm gonna have to make one. I know a few things how to make it. I have not done it, so we're gonna both be learning at the same time. I know you get a new spark plug or a used spark plug, and you take it off, take it apart, just like I got here. It's a spark plug. I already broke the. I already broke the uh, glass off it. Next thing you want to do is take this out and take and get out the center piece, okay? Gosh. All right, I broke off the the metal stick that came out of the spark plug. Next thing I gotta do is I have to take off the um, th hole, make it hollow, okay? All right, now we're gonna go. <laughs> For some reason my phone's a little blurry today. That sucks. All I gotta do is get the um, adapter that'll fit the compression tester. Well, but hey look, it's a hole in it. Get back with you. Alright, now all I gotta do is take and here's the old spark plug piece. And here's a air chuck nozzle. And I'm gonna all I have to do is take and braze it from here onto there. Once I braze that, there is my um compression tester adapter from my scooter. Alright, well let me braze it real quick, get this done, and I'll get back to you, okay? 
All right, I'm gonna start heating this up. Like that. Once I get it hot enough, I'll start braising it. I can't braise it with one hand, so I'll get back to you, okay? All right, there it is. All braised together. Sorry about my camera, it is a little out of focus. But yeah, brazen wire with um, map gas works really good. Right there, map gas. It can be done. There's the, there's the brazen wire. Didn't even use half of it. Well, when it cools down, I will, um, when it cools down, I'll try it in my bike. Thanks. Be back soon. Well, there it is, all together, ready to go. Next thing I'm going to show you is I'm going to put it on and do a compression test. I'll be back. All right, you can see I just installed it. I don't know if you can see in there that green, but it's right there. Just installed. Next thing I have to do is I got to go get my compression tester, which is right here. Got, like I said, got it Harbor Freight. All right, it's locked on there. There we go. Alright, let's see what the compression is. Moment of truth. You can see it, but it's about 70. So, yeah, 70 pounds. It's definitely the compression is wrong with my scooter. Guess I have to do rebuild. Guess it might need um, new valves. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and have a good day. Thanks.